Hey, what's up guys? This is some uh, pre-release information on Diablo 4 Best Character. Uh, uh, Diablo Immortal is their last game they made, and apparently in that one, the Barbarian is the strongest one, is the best character uh, for DPS. For me, my pick, my go-to is always the Necromancer. I know in Diablo 2, it, it kind of kind of was stunted a little bit. You couldn't take it into higher levels as, and have as much fun. But uh, in Diablo Immortal, the Necromancer was pretty fun. They had summons that stay up permanent, and then they had summons that you could bring up uh, every so often when the skill's ready again. I'm thinking the Necromancer is probably going to be pretty high in the list, especially for new players, because all the summons, they take away the aggro and uh, just do the killing for you, do a lot of work for you, a lot less clicking around. Uh, I do not see the Druid uh, as being the first or number one. I, I picture that one as being more of a kind of a weird combination of maybe a Necromancer and uh, maybe a Barbarian or a Necromancer and a Rogue. We have some some kind of uh, animal summons or something like that. He looks pretty big. Looks like bigger than the barbarian, so might have some physical stuff going on there. Uh, the rogue could be good for DPS. Probably kind of squishy. The rogue and sorceress are kind of in the same area. It seems like uh, with their lower defense and uh, higher DPS. Uh, the the sorcerer's probably got higher DPS. Um, and maybe it's more of a glass cannon than the rogue. That's kind of consistent with the, uh, the sorceress and magic casters in these games. Uh, I don't know if I had to, if I had to bet, I'd probably bet on the barbarian or, uh, or maybe the rogue. Um, but I know I'm going to be playing the necromancer, so that's my favorite. All right. That's just a little information on the best character pre-release. Thanks.